Hello guys, this is Ryan Meyer, and recently I have bought a late 2015 MacBook Pro Retina. And this is just no ordinary MacBook Pro Retina 15 inch. This computer has the max settings available from Apple's website, meaning this computer is one to be reckoned with. Now let's dig in to the mid-2015 MacBook Pro. This 2015 MacBook Pro has a notable difference in key travel compared to Apple computers of the past. It just seems more shallow, for whatever reason. On a more positive note, the Force Touch trackpad has excellent tactic feeling and excellent depth in click, even though it's just a vibrating motor underneath. The hinge feels substantial and tight, a very amazing hinge for a very amazing computer. The audio on this computer is some of the loudest audio I have ever heard on a laptop. The following is an unaltered sample of the audio. The specs of this computer include a 1TB Samsung SSD, 16 gigs of RAM standard, an AMD Radeon R9 370X graphics card with 2 gigs of dedicated video memory, coupled by this gorgeous 2880 by 1800 display, which is something that catches the eye of anyone who sees it. Unlike Apple's more recent computers like the new MacBook, this computer still has an Apple logo that lights up. At the moment, this is Apple's most powerful laptop computer. Apple has had many blunders this year, including the Apple MacBook 2015, the new Apple Magic Mouse that charges from the bottom for god knows what reason, and the ugly and protruding iPhone 6 and 6S battery pack. Unlike the previously stated items, the MacBook Pro mid-2015 has an amazing amount of features and a lot of raw power within. Let's just hope in 2016, Apple makes less blunders than they did in the previous year. And as always, thank you for watching, and God bless.